Uh, welcome to your market update and charts of the day as we enter the midpoint of the Asian session. It's the 11th of August. It's Friday, so there'll be an interesting position readjustments by institutional investors. Let's have a look at the news, of course, so far today. Major indices eked out small gains overnight in the US despite giving up major early gains after the cooler than expected CPI number. US futures trading mildly higher in the Asian session. Asian markets are mixed in early trading. The ASX is ending the week down 0.3% today. European futures are pointing to a slightly lower open also, although slightly better than earlier in the Asian session. And the VIX remains near historically low levels after dropping again yesterday. US dollar index finished near neutral after a choppy session. Gold dropped again and may test 1900. Currently sitting around the 200 EMA. Copper's pulled back below 380 and all has also pulled back from the time of highs it hit yesterday. Bitcoin is range bound. Earnings continue, of course, on the data front. We've got UK GDP, the major this afternoon. And then this evening, we're into the US PPI, consumer inflation expectations and consumer sentiment. All due later and all market moving potential. Let's just have a look at a couple of charts that caught our eye today. And the Euro Aussie is one that we're interested in. You can see there it's pushing back up towards this high from earlier in the session. This is really an important level. You can see this was also the high three sessions ago. And we have to take it back an awful long way to see it at this high. So if we do get a bridge of 168.70, that could precipitate some more buying pressure. So one certainly to watch. On the ASX, we're liking Adairs Limited again. You can see it's pushed right back hard up against that 178.5 level that we've discussed before. We see plenty of upside in this, possibly up to $2 in the first instance. If we do get a breach in the last hour, that's around 10% to take us up to $2. A very healthy return in the market right now. So one to watch. If not today, then have another look on Monday to see if we manage to break through this level. Trade safe and we'll see you again soon. Bye bye for now.